Hey there, everybody. I'm CNY Central First Alert Meteorologist Matt Stevens. Hope this early part of the weekend is going well for you. We're typically hitting a high temperature this time of the year in the upper 30s. Now, we're not going to quite get to that today, but we will be warmer compared to what we saw yesterday when we were struggling in the teens. Uh, we ultimately should get up to a high temperature today in the low to middle 30s, so at least a little closer to standard stuff for this time of the year. 20 degrees is our typical low temperature. I think we're in the ballpark of that coming up tonight. I'll show you my thinking in just a moment. 63 degrees, our record high, minus 8, our record low. Both of those are going to stay safe today and tonight. Sunrise, 641. Our sunset 554 and yesterday just over 2.1 or just over 2 inches. So we picked up 2.1 inches of snow officially at the Syracuse Hancock Airport. And how that stacks up for us locally is we have a surplus of snow just about 8 inches. So we're just about 8 inches above average for this time of the snowfall season. All right, 8 o'clock this morning on our future cast. We're going to run this out through the middle of today. And note how there's something hanging out up to our north and northwest. That's a cold front, or I should say some energy and moisture out ahead of a cold front. Ultimately, that cold front doesn't get in here, though, until tonight. So during the daylight hours, early breaks of sunshine will slowly give way to increasing cloudiness today. And we're into the threat of some area wide snow coming up tonight. So during the daylight hours, Breaks of sun, increasing thickening clouds, turning a little breezy by late day today. Coming up tonight into that area wide snow uh, could be good for one to two inches of snow tonight. Tomorrow, after a brief lull, I think we're back into more snow. Uh, it should be area wide, but there will be some subtle differences depending on where you are in the viewing area. So, for example, on Sunday, if you're farther up to the north, I would suspect you have some lighter snow. Central New York light, still light, but slightly more moderate and more moderate snow. So slightly steadier, heavier snow the farther south you head in our viewing area. Southern Hills, for example, could be in for two to four inches of snow, while us in the immediate Syracuse area could be talking about another one to two inches of snow. Call it a trace to an inch well up to the north tomorrow. So hour by hour through this morning, breaks of morning sunshine giving way to slowly increasing cloud cover. 23 degrees by 11 o'clock, topping out at 33 degrees this afternoon. That's still a bit below average, but it is warmer compared to what we saw yesterday. Cloud cover thickening up by late today, and winds picking up a little bit out of the south-southwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And that's going to help us out in the temperature department a little bit today. Heading into this evening, thickening clouds becoming overcast with light snow developing area wide 28 degrees by 11 o'clock area wide light snow continues 19 degrees by 5 o'clock in the morning should be good for a trace to a couple inches area wide. Here's a seven day forecast up to that high of 33 breezy degrees today. 19 our low for tonight. Area wide snow. Brief little Sunday morning, but back into area wide snow and snow showers late morning through the afternoon. Colder at 22 degrees. For Monday, blustery, colder. Look at that, 13 degrees only for a high temperature. And initially, some light lake effect snow showers and flurries for the Finger Lakes, sliding back towards the greater Syracuse area by the afternoon. Wind chills sub zero the vast majority of the day on Monday for Tuesday 19 degrees still well below average for this time of the year a couple light snow showers and flurries round snow showers and steady snow mainly south on Wednesday 13 bone chilling degrees slow moderating trend by the end of the seven day